Hey guys, it's me, Jessica here, Corporate Recruiter, and I am talking about job questions. I'm just answering common job seeker questions. And today's question is, tell me about a time when you saw someone doing something wrong. This person is saying, I got and probably will get again, the behavior-based question. Tell me about a time when you saw someone doing something wrong or breaking or bending a rule. What did you do? What was the result? The question was from an entry level security interview. So I know they want me to say I did nothing um, or they don't want me to say that I did nothing. What are they probably looking for with that question? Okay, so a quick thing I wanna share about behavior-based interview questions. For any behavior-based interview question, you definitely want to use the STAR method, which is basically a model that helps you give a really good, clear, and um, well-received response to the question. So with this type of question, you'd use the STAR model, talk about a specific situation, talk about what was happening in that uh, scenario, what was the task involved, what was, you know, what was happening, what were the actions that you did in that scenario. So in this case, what did you actually do when you saw someone doing something wrong? And then what was the overall result? What happened in the end? Was the issue resolved? Like what actually happened all around? And what made this example a great response to this question is basically what we're kind of looking for. So tell me about a time you saw someone doing something wrong or breaking or bending a rule for a security type of interview. I think it's very important to demonstrate how you actually have the courage to address something that someone was doing wrong. So that's the one thing. I think the next thing that you should talk about is if you followed a spe specific policy or if you um, let anyone that needed to know about the issue and actually bring that up to them, like how serious of the issue was it? What were the ramifications if you did nothing in that scenario? And then what actually happened in the end? Were you able to resolve that issue? Um, and were you able to keep it from happening in the future? So those are some things that you may wanna consider when answering this type of question. And again, thinking about an entry level security type of interview, they're wanting people that are going to kind of, you know, follow procedure. They're going to do what's right. They're going to have the courage to step up and say, hey, this is, you know, this is not within our policy for X, Y, Z reason. And they're also going to want someone that can communicate up to their management when needed. So if it was a scenario where was something seriously happening and there was someone maybe breaking the security protocol, well, you would want to make sure that you share who you communicate it with. Like if you communicate it with your manager, then overall making sure that you share, you know, what was the impact? Like, why was it so great that you have the courage and you were able to actually address that issue and the things actually turn out for the good in that example. So those are some thoughts that I would have. And from a perspective of an interviewer, hopefully that gives you more insight into what someone is looking for with these type of behavioral based interview questions. I definitely think they relate very well to the job. So anything that you know about that job and what the person's looking for is helpful with catering your response and the specific example that you share. Oh, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.